Hey guys, how's it going? Today let's play another DOS first person shooter game. This one comes from 1994 and I'm going to be reviewing this one and the sequel to this game as well. They are Heretic and Hexen. Let's start Heretic first since it's the first one. Alright, Raven Software 1994 created actually for ID software so so actually this is using the Doom Engine. They borrowed it from ID software. They actually use the Doom Engine in this game. Okay, um, okay that's, that's all good and well. We'll go to the first episode and use the setting here. Alright, so one thing you notice is that it uh, does kind of seem like Doom because it's using the same engine. And, and right off the bat you're being attacked. And uh, <laughs> basically you're this mage and sorcerer thing. You can see that I'm using uh, this kind of staff which fires at fantastic creatures like dragons and, and stuff and uh, this this game is very fantasy themed so just think of it like a fantasy it's like doom and it's, instead of um, demons and stuff you're fighting you're fighting like dragons and other fantasy creatures and instead of a marine you're a sorcerer and as usual with doom you cannot jump this is in the build engine where you can actually jump and stuff do mention you cannot jump. Um, you do have different levels you can go under, like this water and stuff, but you cannot go under the water like you can in uh, the build engine. So the Doom engine is not as sophisticated as the build engine is, but it was still good for its time. This was 1994, by the way. Uh, I believe the build engine became popular. Um, well, actually, when when Ken, Ken Silverman made it, but he improved upon it, so. Around 1995 or 6, it started becoming more popular. This is 94. This is around the same year that Doom 2 was also released, which brought in an improved uh, Doom engine. Or ID Tech, that's why they, they call it, I think, ID Tech engine. Got the yellow key. Ooh, what is this guy? This game brings a very creepy atmosphere. Oh my. I like when they die, the spirit comes out of them, the soul. Yes. It's very uh, foreboding, very creepy. I love it. Gauntlets of the Necromancer, nice.
Lower stairs. Come on. There we go. And that counts as Heretic's version of the um, Doom Leaver, I guess. Go to the next level. Um, but yeah, that's Heretic. I'm just going to show the first level because I'm going to show you guys the sequel to this game next. Okay, let me just finish these guys off. Nice skeleton guy here. Oh, nice. But yeah, Heretic's a pretty good game. Um, makes good use of the ID of the ID uh, tech engine, the Doom engine. Made pretty good use of it to see uh, how it would look like in a fantasy setting, and here we have Heretic showing that off. Okay, and let's play the next game in this series, which is called Hexen. Hexen Beyond Heretic is the next game in this series. Let me just make sure I have the right setup here. R R Q seven, just make sure it's on the right channels and stuff. Let's launch that. All right, and here we go, guys. This is Hexen Beyond Heretic, uh, the sequel to Heretic, and uh, it uses the Doom two engine, which you'll notice looks uh, very very similar to the B one engine with a few key changes. Uh, the graphics look a bit better, and you have the ability to jump as well. Which makes it more interesting. So let's just start a game. And the first thing you'll notice that um, you can actually choose a class, which differs from Heretic. So you can choose Fighter, Cleric, or Mage. Uh, fighter has no magic, Mage has no speed, armor, or strength. But I'll just choose Cleric since he's pretty good at everything. And I'll choose the easiest setting here. Alright, so yeah, the first thing you notice is that um, it's very similar to Heretic, it keeps the same kind of fantasy setting. Uh, the same kind of foreboding, dark, creepy atmosphere here as well. And uh, yeah, but the graphics look um, improved since this is using the new ID Tech 2 engine. So it's slightly improved. And uh, I have the ability to jump as well, which is something new added in uh, Doom 2. So yeah, you basically uh, Hexen is just a fantasy version of Doom 2, which is like... Uh, Heretic is a fantasy version of Doom 1, and this is for Doom 2, basically, so, yeah. It's very, very cool. Um, let's see if I can open this. No, I need the Emerald Key. Let me find that somehow. So, yeah, right off the bat, I get attacked by these uh, monsters, which are pretty intriguing monsters. They're uh, pretty frightening, to, at least for me, anyway. Flechettes. Actually, throw these, I think. Yep. Oh, that actually can kill that. Okay, anyway. Sucks I just start out with a melee weapon. I kind of need a long range weapon. I can actually break these. Get stuff, special stuff inside. Quartz flask, okay. Secret passageway here. I wish I had a long range weapon. Alright. Uh. The enemies just spawn randomly.
All right, for that. The Emerald Key, that's where it is. Now I have to get through this trap here. As soon as this goes. There we go. I can go to the store. Sounds like dogs. Cool. Need the silver key for this. I think that is actually over here. Yep. Okay, okay. Hmm. In this bell. Flaming demons now. Kill those demons. Ethical travel. That is pretty scary.
Let's leave here. Finally get a ranged weapon. Finally. Well, that is pretty scary. What are those things? Well, I wish I can look down. I feel travel again. Guys. Gimlet avoiding. Okay. Yeah, this is Hexen. Um, you notice like instead of levels, they have these ethereal travel to different places, which are basically like different levels. Um, but yeah, it's a pretty intriguing game, uh, just like Heretic, it's like a fantasy version of Doom, and it pulls it off quite well, I think it makes good use of the uh, ID Tech 2 engine, uh, really fantastic monsters and uh, weapons, you can choose different classes and stuff, um, obviously this cannot be compared to the other first person shooters that uses the build engine, because I think the build engine is actually more comparable to to uh, the Quake engine, I would say, than this. So, if you wanted to compare this, then uh, compare this to Doom 2, because this is basically what uses the same engine as Doom 2. But yeah, that is, this is uh, Hexen, and uh, if you guys can pick it up on good old games, I think it's there. Oh my god, this, this, this monster is just fantastic. Oh my god, it's some like kind of centaur with a chainsaw. Okay, anyways. Yeah, thanks for watching, and um, be sure to subscribe if you haven't, I have a lot of other videos as well, a lot on DOS games as well, so, yes, that is it, and um, see you guys next time.